Happy Thursday, Anthony Special here with Special Analysis. Hope you're having a great week. Uh, guys, if you enjoy these videos, if you like them, if you find them valuable, please below, like, share, subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. So today we're going to recap on an opportunity that we had sent out, uh, I believe it was last week or earlier this week, um, and that's on Google Class A, ticker G-O-O-G-L. I'm going to open up the, um, the chart here. We'll jump right in and I'll show you what I'm seeing. So... When we had sent out the previous uh, commentary regarding this particular uh, ticker, we were looking at this teal channel here that was running in a, 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 a horizontal manner. Uh, but we finally got that breakout. We got that 1% plus variation, that 1% confirmation close. Um, so I'm looking at how to strategically play this. So let me just confirm we have the 1%. So I take my, uh, my measuring tool. And I go right at that line that we broke out of, that channel top. Uh, and then I measure to the closing price of the candle. So you can see we have nearly uh, a full 2%. Um, I look for 1 plus percent, meaning it's got to be greater than 1%. So this does, in fact, qualify. So this does technically, you know, give us what we call a, a confirmed breakout. So how do I manage this trade from here? This area here where price broke out from should moving forward act as support meaning if price does come back down it should hold the price here um it may penetrate it but it should not close below it so as long as price continues to close above this channel top this teal channel top line i'm my anticipation is price should rise from here where to well there's a couple spots that i'm looking at and i've indicated them on the chart here my first target uh, it's right in this neighborhood, a little short of this ascending channel. Um, I would take off maybe a third of my trade, uh, perhaps even half, depending on how conservative you want to be. At this point, I'd probably consider moving my stop to break even. No reason to turn a winning trade into a losing trade. I'd look to take off my second third or 25% at this uh, channel area of resistance. Again, once that transpired, I would move my stop up from my break-even point to my first target. And then if I left a piece on, a third or 25% or whatever's left, depending on, on the way I, I was strategizing this, um, I would look to fulfill that at, at a full channel completion, which at this point is somewhere in the 3300 mark. So it could that could take a while to go. Time frame. Uh, first two targets could be acquired in three to five weeks. The third target could take three to five months. Um, again, the volatility has been wildly aggressive in the market. Uh, as quick as the market fell, the market could rise. So I'm anticipating that it may not take as long as I would normally think. But this is my thought process. Where does the trade go bad? We have to know what our risk is. Uh, and I would place a stop right below this candle here, where price action had gone from resistance to support. So I'd place a, a stop somewhere in this area right here. Um, so you don't have a huge... From a risk perspective, you're risking less than 5% on this trade. Um, you know, with the intention of taking some profit, taking some profit, and hopefully taking some more profit. So I just wanted to break this down to you because we did get the confirmation. We did get the breakout. This is what we look for, whether it's a future, a stock, Forex, a commodity. It doesn't matter. The strategy is always the same. Um, so I wanted to give you guys an update, let you know that this did confirm last night. I wanted to shoot a video about it, recap it, uh, and then tell you what the thought process would be moving forward from here. Uh, so that's it for today. I just want to, uh, again, get this out here to you. As these trades continue to evolve, we will update on them accordingly, uh, and we'll go from there. So guys, again, if, you, if you're enjoying these videos, if you like them, uh, if you find them useful, informational, please like, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. I greatly appreciate it. You can find me, of course, on all social media outlets and uh, at anthonyspecial.com and also at Traders Agency as well. So with that, I wish you a beautiful and blessed day, and I will talk to you tomorrow.